there, Twitch. Hey there, YouTube. It's Phantasma Knight. I'm always tired, and we're gonna be playing Vampire's Cold, Cold Soul. Yeah, I'm stumbling over my words again. Um, as you can see, I have a little avatar in the corner. Um, I'm not sure this is the best motion capture tech. It could just be my camera's bad, uh, and, and maybe I don't have the right face for this. <laughs> That'd be unfortunate. I don't think that's a thing, but it's easy to get paranoid. Plus, I'm hearing a faint echo. I'm hoping that you guys don't hear this deal. That would be unfortunate. Uh, actually, hang on. I think I might figure it out. One more. Nope. I thought maybe my um, my headset was working for once. I'm still wearing things, the mic and my headphones. Anyway, uh, just give me just a moment, and then we'll get started proper. I want to say the de de developers are Devapresso Games. I could be wrong. Um, they made the Coma, which is a horror game set in a Korean high school. I want to say. Yeah, I could hear my own voice echoing. That really worries me. <coughs> Private bags. All right, this is the place I told you guys about. Looks like the spooks got here first. Was it really worth leaving our regular pack to come all the way out here? We're not patrolling today. Besides, if we don't find more supplies soon, we'll all be in trouble. Have you a better suggestion? I'm not the one who th who have to tell Celeste we came back empty-handed. I don't think I'm doing proper voices. And I can't even keep my voices straight. Like, I already forgot what voice I used for that guy. Shut your piles! Who knows what's lurking about out here? Just look around and see if you can find anything useful. Check out the tutorial graphic above and move out. Character can move left and right. Interactive options with the environment around you. Uh, this is looking like Darkest Dungeon. Inventory, bio, codex, map options, inventory. Yeah. I have no idea if these guys are supposed to be like major recurring characters. Um, I mean, they, they look pretty decent. It's just I remember in the coma, like, one of the strong points was... Hmm. Well, okay, the art was pretty decent for everything, but I remember, like, the villain, like... The villain was fan service, but she was also real good looking. I get the fact that I can hear my voice acting, that bothers me. Anyway, uh, let's see. Can't click on stuff. Do I click with... Okay, I hit E and their swords came out for a moment. I thought that maybe that was me pressing the button, but no, I think that they just do that. Progress has been saved. I feel like an NPC who has uh, who sees the main character in front of them quick saving and pulling out their sword. A door. Is it locked? Open already and keep your guard up. Let's see. Okay, so there'll be icons when I can do stuff. Red X means you are neither accessed area nor engaged with the object. You need to hold the interact button to complete your action and search objects. So I can get knives in the back while I'm trying to do it, right? Is that how it works? Oh, well, that door opened previously. Usual metal creaky door noise. Locked. I found something. Looks like a chest of some sort. Well, what are you waiting for? Okay, here it goes. I can't open it. What? Hmm, I really gotta keep my voice more consistent. Ah, mother, help me. It's a miracle I survived this long in the company of fools. It does a bit, it look a bit more roguelike. Just press and hold the button indicated in the tutorial graphic and voila! It's usually a good idea to have someone with a high slight stat if you hurt in your team to do the dirty work. Oh wait, I was supposed to give her like a higher, more annoying voice simply because I can't do a proper girly voice. Anyway, we're gonna click on it. This chick is the, the main girl, I'm pretty sure, which means these three might be stooges who are going to get killed here in the tutorial. I 
Actually, you can't switch characters. She seems to have the highest light. Oh well. Move aside and live to me. Uh, yeah, I cannot keep my voices consistent. So, so uh, sorry about that. To a box. Scrap meadow. Wood planks. Uh, total of seven weight. I don't know if that's a lot. The chests here are different from the ones back in Adina. Forget the chest. Try checking your inventory and character bios as indicated in the bottom right corner of the screen. Shoot, I don't see anything in the bottom right corner of the screen. Do they mean bottom left? Is this inverted because this was... Wait, don't the greens read left to right? This is the bio. Learn more about your team members, stats, skills, stats, effects, and equipped relics here. Press left or right to toggle between the characters in your team. Oh, I should have tried that. Indicates health, flame, indicates vigor. Uh, let's see, so I can't indicate it's combat, and it represents the character's power of fighting. Slight, it represents ability to scavenge. Merchantry, it represents the abilities. The, the character's ability to negotiate with merchants. Awareness, spot traps. Overwatch, ability to care for the party while camping. Interesting, they call it Overwatch. Overwatch, other than the game, is what I think of when you have a gunner set up, especially with a long range scope gun, providing Overwatch. You know, cover fire. Or like, stealthier precision cover fire. Not just like trying to keep the enemy at bay, but actually like picking off targets of opportunity to you know, keep you alive as long as possible. See, combat spells can perform with fighting. Well, well, that's good. I'd be worried if I couldn't perform them while fighting. Normal skills, default abilities. Flourish skill can only be used if it's been charged with flourish points. Information button. Dismiss. Let's see, view combat damage one. Hang on, I've got to move this uh, chat box thing. Okay, deal common damage to one short range target, heal 4 health, receive inspired status. What is, it, what is it inspired? You gonna tell me? No? Alright, that's fine. Uh, unless I'm very much mistaken, this E is inverted and this Q is inverted. Might be, maybe I just don't remember the spell. Nope, this, uh, this Q is inverted. Interesting. Uh, I'm not not gonna remember this. This is the kind of game that I take a very long time trying to figure out. Uh, this is left and right. Uh, was there another left and right? Maybe I have to open this. Oh, and now I press left and right. Yep, she's definitely a rogue type. Oh, that's not even a toothpick. That's a freaking lockpick. So, uh, warrior, tank, well, that basically warrior with a shield, and rogue type. Hmm. You know, the only problem about cleavage windows is that, I mean, that kind of leaves your heart unprotected. I mean, I like the look, but, you know. Anyway, let's keep going. Alright, alright, grab that. Okay. <laughs> Does feel a little bit like Darkest Dungeon. It's freezing out here. You think the spooks are getting close? Did you forget to bring the Geist meter again? We should keep going. No use going back the way we came where they are. Stay put for too long, they'll catch up. Remember, your health or vigor drop to zero, we'll be the ones spooking the place. Let's go. I feel uneasy. This place gives me the creeps. It should. You guys apparently have a meter for looking for ghosts. Okay, if you're not health, you die. Makes sense. You run out of vigor, you die. Okay, that's uh, not quite what I thought it was. Stress of expiration. So, sanity. Flourish points through critical action bonuses and finishing turns during combat. 
cool. Huh, can I? Can I? This guy's got a spear. Wait, he also has a shield. This isn't, this isn't a half bad looking sword. Infrasonic totem. Strange tension. Health minus two, hand tremors. Man, I'm looking over at OBS right now. This, uh. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about this avatar. I'm also blocking some of the buttons. That's kind of the problem with having these kind of avatars. You're gonna block up something. Okay, I tried to duck out of the way, but I think I just kind of desynced the camera movement. Okay, weird. Man, I shouldn't take too long in this. Like, I know I keep seeing this every stream. I really should stop. Uh, how do I... Okay. Another trap! Best to have someone with a high awareness stat in your team to avoid them. Traps are a dangerous feature of... Ice Nair? Ice Nair? Yeah, high awareness. Low awareness. Huh. Um, hmm. So, I mean, high awareness is how you avoid the traps. Does that mean that even if you don't have high awareness, there's a chance that... Or rather, even if you don't notice the trap, there's a chance that you won't trigger it? Uh, you know, unless someone has, like, low awareness. Probability failure. Green equals good, got it. Red equals bad, got it. Gray means you missed! You missed! How could you miss? How could you miss? I'm kidding. Blue's crit. Blue's crit. Okay. Okay. Still haven't gone into any fighting yet. I just saw something move in the distance. Get your weapons ready and think fast. Let's make sure we all get home today. <laughs> she has she has the voice I try to do for her is the most inconsistent of them all. But you guys can hear it better than me. I really hope this echo I'm hearing doesn't come down together. Okay, uh, we're playing Dark Extension then. Huh, you can get a first point from defending. I thought it was crit at the end of your turn. Man, I have no attention span. I'm all already like getting sleepy, and I'm just like, eh. These mad survivors, like he looks the creepiest with this wide grin, and as creepy as they look, I think they look much prettier. Is it because just the grin, or I don't know? I guess women gotta be pretty even when they're insane. Anyway, what do I do? Uh. I can't see the enemies. Uh, that. I, okay, I don't like this. Short, mid, long. Uh, short only available when you're in the front. And can only target guys in the front. Mid can be used any position, but can only target enemies in the front. Long can be used any position, target any position. Okay, so it simplifies a little bit from Dark Extension. Choose your target. Can I not see the dudes? <laughs> yeah, that worries me that I can't see everyone at once. That was, Dark Ascendant is a lot nicer for that. And I firmly believe that this game had to have copied Dark Ascendant. There's way too many similarities. I mean, it's possible this game came out first, but I doubt it. Wait, do they... Do they not tell me what my abilities are just by hovering over them? Ooh, I don't like that. Yeah, I'm starting to see why this game has mixed reveals. So you pray for health and inspire status. Oh, inspire status gives you plus one combat. I think that's what it does. Uh, but for now, I'm just going to be a typical violent brute and swing away.
That looked very Darkest Dungeon-esque. Um, I mean, we're just gonna attack, right? Yeah, let's just attack. And before that, I do want to see what this thing does. Let's see. I can't tell which one. Oh, these are both Flourish abilities. Okay, I didn't see that. Four wind deal, four true damage to mid range targets. Um, I thought that was a pickaxe. A long range target. Powerless stats for combat. Minus three for one card. That's cool. Anyway, we're just gonna swing though. I really don't like how you can't see the enemies when you're looking at your own team. <laughs> that did look pretty insane. Didn't look effective insane, just looked like dumb insane. Weirdos. Okay, was the shuriken a um Oh, is this stuff the the flourish? What is this screen? Equipment I guess. Uh I kinda dislike that I can't just like right click. Okay, well I could use escape. That's good. That's something I'm familiar with. I keep using escape in Dead Space 3, it keeps screwing me over. Yeah, she's a cool. Oh, I can't attack her, she's in the back. Okay. Blah. Sarge is better at fighting and at looking for, through chests and stuff. Yeah, Sarge is just better in every way. Dang, Sarge! I told you guys I got a bad feeling about this place. Uh, alright, this is big. The other guy's wet. Wait, Wags and Bitch? How did I mess that? I swear, my IQ goes down when I'm streaming, even when I'm not talking. I, I should have caught that right away. You are the one who insisted we come out here to begin with. By all means, continue quarreling amongst yourselves if you want to be ice pops. We have the spoils we came for, and it's colder than a witch's tit here. I, for one, am ready to return. Your my own voice does make hard to read, too. Hold up, guys. I see a body. It looks like a girl. Who is it? Looks like a protagonist. Is that a gun? <laughs> She's not from Daylarch. I don't recognize her, and no other scavenging teams came up here today. Well, we can't help her now. Search the body. Seriously? You search her. Wait, she's still breathing. We should help her. Wrong voice. Who knows how long she's been out here. You want to bring her back? Are you mad? We have no clue who she is. She could be with the green flame for all we know. She doesn't look like one of them. We can't risk compromising Dale Arch's location. Celeste will have her next. And what if she knows how to cast out strange magic? We don't have time to worry about that. She's unconscious. Captain Lanville shall decide her fate. Looks like it's your lucky day, girl. I once read, a man would have to go below the waves to understand the true scale of an iceberg. Reminds me of you, dear father. I confess, I never really knew you. After all, how does one get the measure of a man when there's so much beneath the surface? 
Nevertheless, I owe my survival of Zumurud's blistering deserts and the wild forests of Sylvia to your training. When I was summoned home to Edina, in order to read your last will and testament, I didn't know what to expect. I suppose it comes as no surprise you remained a mystery even in death. I now find myself beckoned to the dwarven realm of Darkheim by the encrypted journal and ancient relic he left behind. On an expedition to the cursed city of Isenair for answers you never provided. I shall not be daunted. My determination is equal to the task at hand. If, as you say, this Vambrace is the key to entering that forbidden city. I will find what I seek. My journey has been difficult. Since the Vambrace entered my possession, I have been plagued by unsettling dreams of a ghostly blade cutting me down. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. So there's some voice acting this one. And that wasn't a gun, that was a pickaxe. Pickaxe. With some wires coming off it. The handle was kind of interesting looking. I think that's why what made me think it was a gun. And fan brace I believe is a type of bracer, like bracer, like you know, a bit of armor you wear on your arm. One that gives you visions of dying. You know, Chad, I don't want to read anymore. I, read anymore. I mean, Sarge wasn't bad looking, but she's way too cute for me to be pretending, <laughs> uh, uh, pretending to be speaking for her. Speaking for her. Um, um, should I be reading? I be reading? <sighs> you know, I'm going to forgo it for now. For There's, now. No There's no demand for it. There's no demand for anything. No demand for anything. You know, I wasn't paying attention. I thought he was asking how she's doing. No, she, he called her Sleeping Beauty sarcastically. Evelia Lyric. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. Lanville Esquire. Gracing the streets. She was, she was on the streets. Celeste had half a mind to leave you up there, and good for you. She's not calling the shots, and I was feeling generous. Up there, and here they were like on a mountain or higher elevation or something. Strange book no one can read. Climbing gear. Climbing gear is useful. Her father is the late Nicolau Lyric. Uh, I suppose it's good not to believe every little thing, but uh, <laughs> when you have decent reason then to suspect that a character is the protagonist and is an honest protagonist and someone else immediately dismisses their story as that of a liar, it's kind of funny. Especially when you witness the events for yourself, which we haven't actually. Spooks, mad survivors of the green flame. Uh, huh. Uh, huh. Uh, this is gonna be unpleasant. Arconic cold. Let's try the guardian alive. Uh, well, you said that you were going to uh, pretend for a moment that you believe her absurd story, right? Uh, 
Access that card. You're just letting me go, she says. Well, I'm alright with that. Hellion. Hellion. In the little hellhole of the, the frozen pits of the Ekta in the world. <laughs> I've never seen paper money, she says. You know, as rude as he's being, he doesn't lock her up and even gives her money. Clear as crystal. She does look pretty. Like a K-pop idol. I don't think uh, K-pop idols generally have hetero heterochromia. Then again, I mean, they're Asian, so they dye their hair, but they need like color contacts for that. Usually. Wait, what did I was bank to Jen? Oh, hold Chef. Codex Illum Illuminous. So the Book of Light. Okay, okay. okay, okay. Kind of an early looking pickaxe. My progress has been saved over and over and over. So much salvation. Can I, can I talk to you? Can I talk to you? Can't duck. Can't duck. Can't jump. Can't jump. Sprint. Sprint. Okay, that's a funny run. Funny run. That's a funny run. Psycho, like, oh yeah. Like, oh yeah. <laughs> There's a certain awkwardness to the animation, but I mean, just like still pictures are really well drawn, I'd say. They're NPC at least twice, right? <laughs> How to keep your body warm? Step, step one, make a fire. It's like, well, sure, I'm not gonna roll around the snow. Step two, stay in front of the fire. Well, yeah, I'm not gonna jump into it. Step three, be warm. You know what? I'm gonna be cold instead. She's in the cell. Pretty sure she's in the cell, and it's not that I'm the one in the cell. Partly because of the crappy looking bed, the the chains hanging from the wall, the the big ball and chain attached to our ankles, which are tied together. It, you know, if she was actually tied to the wall, that would give me like the worst impressions. Hmm. Isabel Salazar. The woman knows black magic, consider yourself warned. Looks so familiar. Well, you're both K-pop idols. I can't tell. Are you guys sisters? Is she your mom? Your presence here pretty much English. <laughs> Don't you hate it when you, you know that as a protagonist, you're a harbinger of dis I was gonna say disaster, but despair might fit better. Exit out that way. Oh, I. Oh, I. Hmm. I don't like how hunchback she is. Like, what is that? What is that? What is this? How How do I feel about this? I don't know how I feel about this. Suddenly, everyone looks out like. Wow, they're being polite. They even apologize. What happens if I try again? Oh, they just repeat themselves. Half expected her to get all ticked off. She seems to be an adventurer. Maybe free now, but you're still not right here. Step away. This guy's butt is an iron wall. No, is this guy stopping me, probably. Is 
You know, I want to make it seem like it's the sensible thing to just, like, let her die on the cold. So it makes me wonder why those Avengers decided to bring her back. Do you have an inventory system? Tab? No. Uh, I didn't work. U, O, P. Okay, there's clearly only one place that I'm supposed to go, and maybe I should try that because it looks like no one else can go here. Okay, so we have uh, the guard barracks, we have some kind of healing hall with elves, we've got some kind of tavern here. What was this again? Right, some kind of adventure guild. I do not. <laughs> I do not like this run cycle. It's funny, but somehow it bothers me even more than the other one. Prohibited area. But why? What's in there? It looks. I mean, it looks like an elevator of some sort. It brings. You, oh, this must be the exit. This place is underground, so that brings you up to the frozen surface. Uh, books. Probably magic. Eldritch Library. Yeah, but the way that they talk about people that knows people that know black magic. I don't know if a place called Eldritch Library is that nice. What's in this library? Look ancient. Oh, I touched something. Huh. 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 God, I can hear the weird noise that I'm making. Huh. 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 Uh, Hollow Knight was a great game. Um, I was trying to imitate one of the grub noises. Probably didn't do a very good job. Uh, this is one of those games I don't think I'd ever play on stream. As fun as it was, it's way too difficult. Elves and dwarves! I can't sprint out here. Ryan, the noises from my keyboard are probably exceptionally loud. <laughs> I shouldn't be wasting time checking all these out, but I kinda wanna. Migrant Shantytown. You need... You need proper documentation to go into the Shantytown? That's kinda fascinating. Are they like the slim? Uh, I mean the slums? It looks like the sewers are draining out there. There's some kind of ominous crystal thing. Naziri Camp. Oh, Dark Elves. Huh, Dark Elves aren't cute with everyone else. Maybe they're goblins. I didn't get a good look at them. Alright, I keep trying to sprint. Keep thinking I could just go into places instead of having to click on it. Uh, cat people or fox people? Where am I on the screen? Oh. Oh, you're not permitted to be roaming around here? Wait a minute, please. I'll be right back.
Um, this guy is a is a security risk, but um, it make, makes me wonder what his objective is. I mean, who knows how big this place is? But it sounds like it's a city. Yeah, he he helped you out. You could uh, at least like skirt around it, <laughs> for a, or the. Uh, the, 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 the truth. A humble adventurer got stuck in the wrong place at the wrong time, huh? He seems nice enough, but you know what they say don't follow strangers, don't take food from strangers. I like his sort of walk cycle. Oh. Uh, <laughs> this name and that face. I I want to say she's like the ghost hunting girl from um, the coma. Speaking of which, I need to play the coma too at some point. They don't use gold here. Don't you have any hellion? I'm tempted to pronounce it as Foxier, but I think this is Foxier. Now the currency of choice for spooks. Wait, for spooks? Didn't you guys say the spooks are dead people? Let's see. Sober Wraiths. Uh, you know, the thing they said about burning money is offering, um, like, I've seen that done before. Like, it's fake money, but... Yeah. Burn his offering to the ancestral spirits or whatever. Okay, let's see. Liking the music of this game. The art style is pretty nice. Um, the animation's a bit, uh, creepy at times, but it's pretty nice. Is he and sprain. Okay, I, I could guess. I feel like this game probably puts more effort into the whole camping menu thing than Dark Extended did. Dark Extended was fascinating though. These could have been some nutrition. Huh, usually it would be like it's nutrition but it tastes horrible. Huh. That's an interesting trade off. Elven T. If I don't have there we go. Yeah, this is a lot of status conditions. I'm a little scared. It tastes very good. Doesn't look very appealing either. Crazy centipede thing. Can't tell what her health is. Hopefully I'm a full health, right? To start the game. Maybe she did collapse in the cold. The forest and sleepy. Rouse the consciousness. I feel like fa that should cure pain and sleepy, but. Hmm. Naziri Fire Brew. <laughs> Aren't fiery drinks supposed to be like a dwarven thing? Yeah, lots of stats ailments. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Wait. I miscounted. The 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10. Wow, I can't even count to 10. My brain does not work. What's streaming? I've barely played any games other than streaming the past month, though. Uh, she's some kind of captain of the guard, isn't she? Oh, uh, she might be the head honcho, actually. <laughs> You're free to go. You're arrested. You're free to go. You're arrested. Oh, well, that actually makes sense. Uh, well, 
I'm sure these green flames have some distinctive gear. Unless this uh, van brace of hers is one of those things. I suppose there might be some in someone insane enough to risk death wearing like basic gear and to infiltrate the city and spy on or whatever. Not that her gear looks basic at all, but you know. She looks like she's wearing armor. That lady from before, wasn't she just like a thief type? Actually, this can't be that Sarge from before. Now uh, maybe she's Sarge's superior. Because Sarge had that cleavage window I commented on. I'm not buying your hat. Uh, like I said, in this kind of situation it's good to be suspicious, but it's kind of funny when they're like, you can't fool me, and it's like, no one's trying to fool you, you're fooling yourself. Congratulations, you played yourself. The dwarves and drifters. Are the drifters the elves? That, uh, uh, cutely shocked face. The King of Shades. What the heck is that? The Shade Lord. The Shadow Lord. Shadow Lord. Mm. She's pretty, but that expression is kind of ugly. <laughs> I wonder who's higher in command. Celeste or Landville? <laughs> uh, wasn't he speaking normally? I guess he started yelling either because he couldn't hold it anymore or because he's like, this stupid bitch needs to hear this. Ah, oh, crap. I told myself I wasn't gonna swear on stream much. How could this be? Well, clearly the outsider cast some evil spell to let them in. I don't know. Oh man, for, I don't know what those things are supposed to be, but they look kind of like old man dentures that have just popped out of the guy's face. That's no ordinary spook, it's gotten that. Um, are you saying the spooks are normally saying? I, I guess so, if they could spend money. That was an awkward jump. calls him sir. So he's clearly in charge, but she's still arrested at her. Again. So that witch is definitely going to be a party member at some point. Where am I going? I barely made any progress, it's nearly been an hour. What, what am I even doing? Huh. huh. I'm gonna make strange noises, like strange Minecraft Vigor noises every time I pick one of those up. Solution to the crisis. You guys are like, pulled in here. The City of Ice. It almost reminds me of the Jail of the Mist from Code Vein. Which is a game I was thinking of uh, playing like maybe once on on stream. I, like I was talking about Hollow Knight earlier, and I think of Hollow Knight, Dark Souls, and any Souls-like game is pretty much the same way. Probably shouldn't play it on stream. There's just gonna be excessive amounts of dying. I'm not even paying attention. I'm not talking too much. Captain Sawyer. Is there a high-ranking captain here? No, I thought it's funny. I thought that. I think part of me thought that if you're the like the highest ranking military guy in the in the known I don't know civilization or country or whatever, then you should automatically be a general. But I mean, I think 
officer ranks are dependent quite a bit on like the size of the force you're leading. I mean, I'm sure there's like just being promoted just because you know you've been around for a while, you do good stuff. Kind of potion making room. Wood plants. Look at look at that view. Like this, I like, came there. That's that's kind of cool. Yep, I'm just gonna. Huh. Do it. huh. Um, so, I gotta ask, how far can you throw me? Oh, hey, she believes you. Did you go through the frost fell? Ah, that expression. Here, I was gonna hide in a closet. You know, they're, they're run at I mean, their walk animations look pretty decent. She just looks like a typical adventure type some real high heels considering the rest of her armor. And I guess she's got tights on. But the rest of it looks almost a, like looks actually like adventurer like and not just like fan service adventurer. Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. That's new. I thought she was just gonna say several variants of huh. There's more? Uh -huh. huh. huh. Dagger stuck in the table. Like, this is kind of looking fancy, right? See, like, I don't know if those are supposed to be feathers or leaves, but it looks like a torn miniskirt. Huh. Ah, people are walking around. Guardian soldiers appear across the five realms. Three cities up there. Shaking. Okay, so we're playing Darkest Dungeon in the Jail of the Mess, and we're fighting the Shadow Lord. I thought these were white tights, but maybe they're thicker pants. Looks like the seams are on the back of the legs, though. How do you recognize when a character is a potential party member? Looks a little different from everyone else. Yes. Oh, shoot. He's the bigger boss. Or, oh. Oh, wow. He is the bigger boss. What, Ventru? Wait, how long did she say she was searching? Months? Set board? But she's clearly not a villain, she's clearly a party member. Actually, I can't say that for sure. Um, the pretty much only enemy in, in the coma is pretty looking, although she does kind of evolve across the course of the game. Oh, okay, well that changes things. She's not just a witch. Just, she doesn't just know black magic. She's actually one of the enemy bosses from the planet, really. Frost fence. Frost fence, frost fell. Did she go through by herself? Does her van brace let her bring together a party? It's not she should give it to you. She shouldn't give it to you. Why should she? For your protection? No, she... You guys, for your own safety, for your own 
I guess, I guess progress. You should take it from her, but I don't think she should give it to you. Oh, she can't remove it. Oh, well, you know, there's a simple answer to that. Just cut off your arm. Good thing these people aren't killed, though. Uh, ass hats, right? Oh, wow, she even says cutting off her arm. Well, now that she says that, I suddenly suspect that she won't be able to get rid of it even if she does cut off her arm. I'm kidding. If she says that, it's actually more likely as foreshadowing that her arm will be cut off at some point. But it's... it's unlikely. It's just a small possibility. Tracking mission. Scroll consent. Hell, hell, get the lost lady egg. Entertainment district. Okay, so you hire mercenaries and go on, on an adventure! Mm. He looks like a young Bishonen type, and you zoom up on him, he looks. Well, I'm still fairly young, but a little older. Scar on his left. Captain doesn't talk in front of the big boss. Wait, the heck is this? Secret passage? To a closet? Is that... Is that how it works? Did I? Huh! Huh! huh. I didn't miss that. Okay, this is a different room. This one doesn't have the dagger in there. I just noticed all the blood over the... <laughs> the health bars. I feel like... That would be a nicer touch if they didn't have it here, but they had to hear when you, you get someone killed. <clears throat> oh, that's a lot of dark glaring. Uh, Hello there. North Venture Company. Travels real fast. The Oxe? I don't know much Korean. And by much Korean, I mean I don't know anything about the language, but I don't know much about their fiction or folklore at all. So it looks like a Korean word. Money. I know, like money and shops and so on. It's a, it's a game mechanic. Realistically, if you had people holding back too much, like I mean, they're probably giving you like good deals and stuff, especially if you're the hero. But if they like charge you for every little thing, and you keep getting into fights, helping people out, at some point you're just gonna be broke. You know, your your tools are gonna break down, your um, cloaks are gonna get shredded or whatever. I say cloaks, probably more clothes. Cloaks, you know, well, with cloaks, I mean, like, you know, traveling stuff. Huh. And yeah, you're just gonna run out of resources, and at some point they'll be like, sorry, we won't sell you anymore, even though the war is aggressive, and then, I don't know, sin blows the whole world up, then the gun blasts the crap out of the world. Uh. Yep. Close. Uh, I'm trying to remember, I, I want to say I, the, 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 the Bosa Cycle, was that the name of that Norseman? I'm, I'm not quite sure. Huh. Part's made of, Shred engineering, Sibani, hedge magic, enchanted apples. Held into it. Okay, oh, he's excited to see some machinery. Crafting. I think they understand me, but don't see some right. Oh, this is her cabinet, that's cool. Now, if only I could climb in the cabinet and get out into the market, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? 
Exactly. Um, hmm. How do I? It clearly looks like I'm supposed to go there. Maybe there's something that I'm missing. Okay, so if I'm close enough to the door, the door icon will appear, and then I can just go in. Sindri. Okay, we're definitely going to Norse mythology. I don't remember much about Sindri, but uh, he definitely shows up in the God of War game. The new one. The Norse mythology one. Ah, she's a crafting nut. That they said that, that you can't use items or switch, uh, I don't know, equipment or whatever in battle, but there's the stuff that you use specifically during camping. I think that's a nice distinction. It doesn't work for most RPGs, but for a bit more um, these kind of like survival and the wilderness kind of settings. I think that, that's a nice touch. Sweet. <laughs> I branch. That's a freaking that's a burger. burger. Holy crap. That's a light rash, and now I need to see what the bigger rashes look like. And these things actually look different. I was right, uh, <laughs> the the artwork is the is one of the strongest points. Actually, I was going to say it's the strongest point, but the music is very nice. You know, I'm looking over at OBS again. Um, I'm not sure this whole VTuber... Well, I mean, I don't know. Maybe this is low quality rig. Maybe my camera's bad. Maybe face rig isn't meant for this kind of thing. Because I just see my mouth just like flopping open and closed. And I know I have more mouth movements than that. Also, sometimes when I just move my head a lot, I think my mouth opens. Or the avatar's mouth opens. I can't see. I am not actually looking at closely at the screen while I'm shaking my head around. Anyway, anyway, there's nothing for us here. Let's keep going. Bag of herbs. Bag of seeds. Wow. I like crystal. Okay, well, uh, let's get out of here. Save again, going into the door. No one's standing guard here anymore. <laughs> Champion. Ah, oh, they're playing cards. Nah. And when they said tonight's just not your night, I thought like something terrible had happened. Greetings. Oh god. Is she. Is it racist to suspect that she was a dwarf because of how stocky she is? Although, when I first saw her, I was like, it's a buff barkeeper. Space behind the bar that's being used for storage. That's, uh, man, I expected a cover in the staircase or something. Space behind the bar. Man, she's a nice girl. For someone who's used to roughing it up, she looks way too good. Huh. God, if I actually continue to play this game on stream, I'm gonna be making this noise all the time. I 
I haven't seen it myself, but our friend from the market mentioned that. So it's worth it. So it's as good as it was. Yeah, I believe that's the day I sh shaved my beard. Yeah, drawers aren't big on shaving their beards usually. Watch your step when one trip downstairs and bust up right head of yours. Was that genuine advice? Or is she like jelly of how good looking this girl is? Working girl and implies that. Kind of implies that she's a hooker, but I don't know. Like, she's got this major eyeshadow going on. Some cleavage showing. But, I mean. I guess this is a cool place. I guess even if you're in that line of work, you wouldn't be dressed too lightly. But there's like fires burning here, right? But man, even look at this, like. What's the point of looking like a clown if you're a musician? I mean, I guess for the style, but like your partner clearly isn't. Maybe he doubles uh, as like a clown, like doing like little acts and performances. But yeah, even he's thickly dressed. Right, that door was locked. I looked at it like five times. <laughs> Lady in red's back. Charlotte Lorelei. Princess Lorelei. Yeah. Wow, she really isn't red. Like, I don't know what I was thinking, but... That's a good point. The venturing life, I mean, I'm sure it's about the same as being like a mercenary. People die all the time. Except mercenaries, they're expected to fight other people, so yeah, they definitely die. She's certainly pretty, but the main character is the best looking girl in my opinion. No surprise, she is the main girl. Leaving empty mugs and bus turn around. Because this is the box office, doesn't mean we have to die. Doesn't mean we have to act like bees. Lots of ribbon. Ah, this must be that lady's room. No one else wears, wears quite that shade of red. Actually, now that I think about it... Okay, she's definitely got some lip color there, but it's fairly subtle compared to, um, well, you know, this shade of red. Speaking of which, there was uh, this. These devs made some kind of little red writing for the game. Um, it seemed like, I mean, like the little red in that game is some kind of like adventure or something. I think she does fight. But she runs around in like short shorts. So uh, not the old school little red riding hood. Hey there. Oh, real nice. Others are like Outlander. They're in the prison. Interrogate her. Well, this this is way better than I expected. When she said a space behind the bar, I was like, uh, maybe by bar she meant the whole building and not just that the counter. Is, is there actually is it actually gonna look different? Oh, she did tidy it up. Reminds me a little bit of Persona. Five? Yeah, five. You, you go to a new place, you have to clean up all the rubbish, and then you have a really decent looking room. Unlock new skins as you progress. And here I thought this was going to be where all the DLC stuff is. You know, charging a couple bucks for a new outfit. Uh, this looks like she just stripped off all her gear. Dang, her chest got real obvious in this outfit. I'm just gonna check this out for a moment. Um, empty. Can I leave like this? Huh. How do I. Okay, and it. Change her avatar, you saw that graphic popped up. Um, yeah, that's nice. That's a nice touch, I'd say. Anyway, let's get her back into some more stuff. Also, I just really like this outfit. It's really good. Wait, uh, which one? Which one? 
Okay, so the Vampire is the fancy looking one on our left arm. Assuming this game is in mirrored for some reason. Hmm. Ah, that, that's a good point. Cold stone ground. Sleeping on the ground is not comfortable. Like, even if you got like a sleeping bag under you, even if you're on dirt and not rocks or stone. This place is freezing cold too. I don't think so. A lot of space though. Okay, well, uh, let's get out of here. Huh. Bad for running water. Jeez. This is uh, way better than I thought when they said it's just some space behind the bar, and when this girl said it's just dumb. Anyway, go to sleep. I've made next to no progress in this game, but I think I am still gonna end it relatively early. I uh, wanted to pop into a friend's stream after all. She doesn't stream every day of the week, and uh, I've been streaming every day for nearly a month now, but I think I'm gonna hit the one month mark, like, either today or in the next couple of days. I don't know. Actually, I think maybe I already hit the one month mark, I don't know. Even though I haven't quite hit it, it doesn't matter. Um, I'm going to start taking Wednesdays off. Yeah. Everyone just trusts the Outlander, but there are people who are just uh, like, yeah, sure, we're going to join up with you. Uh, I guess if they're desperate, they think that there's a chance of getting money. And plus, hey, she hasn't determined that she could bring other people through this frost fence. Fox people. Harcaster? Is that is that like an actual name or is that just like a sort of like an adventure name, you know, a nom de guerre? Scoundrel. Maybe this is actually their class. Sand is with his face. Simply for opportunity to bring something back. Okay, that makes sense. This mass definitely, I mean, it, it reminds me of a Plague Doctor mass in general, but somehow it reminds me distinctly of the Plague Doctor Dark Extended. Maybe because this game does kind of resemble Dark Extended in some ways. This check. Exposed village in this weather. Well, my elves are often depicted as being superior in some way, shape, or form. Maybe they just put up with the cold. Okay, I'm sorry, but I'm a <laughs> not a stickler. Uh, what's the what's the word? Um, I can't remember the saying. I'm a something. Uh, no, I'm a sucker for a pretty correct face. So, yeah, great range. Also, I like mages. Wait, is she mage? Is that mage symbol or is that or is she an archer? Archcaster, like a bowcaster. Like, casting doesn't actually mean casting spells. It can be casting arrows, but it's just you don't, you don't see that context as much. Heck yeah, you need her. And I want to grab her. She looks pretty as well. But, uh, let's uh, grab this guy because he's got a shotgun. Or shotgun shells. Um, I don't know if there's any advantage to not going with a full party. Well, I didn't even read the scriptures, I just grabbed them. Great reporter, great scouting. Scouting's probably really good. And she fights as well as this guy. Great porter. So he could carry a lot? He's got more health, he's got more vigor, but his stats are lower. Yep, yeah, going with pretty face. You know what? I'm not generally fond of the dwarves in video games. Like, like that nose. Look at that massive beard. 
This helmet actually looks kind of cool. But I'm still going with her. Right. I keep forgetting I gotta press something down here instead of just like double clicking or something. Now that I look at her, is she wearing the same outfit as that Sarge lady? Maybe. My memory's pretty lousy. The head's suddenly different. Okay. Let's just try to get some progress done. Hopefully this game isn't painstakingly long. Like, as cool as... Oh, that, that's neat. As cool as Darkest Dungeon is, I feel like I have to play a lot of dungeons and to make very low progress. I do. What is this thing? Dwarven Engineering, Reaching the Surface... Ascending room moves up and down and side to side. So location on the surface quickly and securely. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Virtually impossible to detect. Huh. I I don't know about that. Archonic magic. Huh. Archon, I believe, is a ancient. I want to say Greek word that means ruler, although I think an archon is like a local magistrate. Or maybe it's some kind of higher magistrate, you know, some kind of official. Some kind of ruling official. Let's see. Dwarven King. Imagery used by the augurs. The most of the so it is where lions. Augur. Say has something to do with the word augury, which I'm not actually sure the exact definition of, despite seeing it in video games. Um, or tabletop role playing games. In D and D, augur means. I mean, augury is like a um, like you're asking. Someone talk. Uh, An augury is like asking for a divine guidance, I guess. To look at a northern quarter of Isenair, unlike most Roman cities, which are rigid and homogenous, prospered greatly from his laissez faire policies in open nature. Years passed, burgeoning quarters satisfied all manner of vices for the diverse populace. Now it's in complete ruin, but there's also, but there's still the Ghost Bazaar, trading hub, open for business, and spooks are even willing to deal with the living who bring hell money to the table. Hence Hellion, got it. Okay. I don't have any supplies. Should I be worried? I should probably be terrified. Be terrified. People are gonna die. People are gonna die. In the depths of the darkest dungeon. Darkest dungeon. Oh man, I really hope my voice is <sighs> echoing for the actual stream. Health and vigor. Sounds like the Overwatcher has to do all the work. Do they get any rest? Shalmancer's a fencer, that's cool. I don't know why fencers can use ravens. <laughs> uh, I, I like these character artworks. Huh, okay, so she's a melee person, slash whirlwind, but she does have a shot ability. Wait, is... Is this pickaxe also a crossbow? That's cool. Okay, she's definitely an archer. So an arc caster is, a, is an archer. She casts this from an arc or a, a bow, I guess. In that case, I should move her to the back. He has a really long gun. Yeah, he looks like a back unit. Yep, need her in the front. I don't know I need her in the front, but uh, I mean, her flashbang can be used from anywhere, but her slash kick needs to be in the front to use. 
Okay, let's move her to the front. Oh, uh, wait, hang on. Oh, I like these uh, these character models, they're nice. I guess she and she are the, more or less the same class. The postures are the same, it's because they're both human. But they got the fur coating and they're definitely warrior types. Anyway. How do I... Oh no. Okay, uh, <laughs> these controls are a tad awkward, but they work. They work. Dude, look at that gun. Holy crap, he's so short, I didn't even see that he was in the party at first, but his gun just stuck out like crazy. His gun is the tallest member of the party. Huh. Kind of guards close to the worst entrances. It's just that, that. This is an interesting looking tool. Sarge. Yeah, same outfit, scarf. Uh, the leather boot plates, the sort of cleavage window. Yeah, it's about camping. Uh, let's see, you could camp spot. High stat. But they, you need to look for good spots too. Dangerous. The spooks. But ectoplasm is usually more like a liquid or at least. Well, gas is technically fluid, but usually when you say fluid, you think of something a little closer to liquid. Ah, uh, this is your. How long to your next random encounter? Wait, did it say stay away from threat? You can actually avoid threats? You know, I, I need to look at stats again. Huh. Two in combat, one and everything else. I didn't expect your stats to be quite this low, but I... Actually, hang on a moment. Yeah, her stats are super low. I did expect her to be fairly well balanced, though. Because, I mean, you're stuck with a main character that you don't get to choose, and but you have to make a party of people. You would either... You would, you'd probably end up building around your main character. like a veil of like blue mist or something that kills when people go through it, but it's a bunch of ice spikes. Huh, so she can break these, but she can just walk through the big one. Interesting. Hey. Huh. Huh. Man, I'm gonna have to look at the codex sometime. I don't know if I'll read through it. Most likely not. There was a lot to read through in uh, Play Tale as well. A simple merchant of fine wares. Why can't you trust the spook? You don't know anything about them. <laughs> magic does ne neither blood nor your hedge. That's interesting. Hedge magic usually means like you're not a real magic practitioner. Hang on, my headphones got unplugged. But here it might be referring to like bushes and stuff, you know, plants, nature magic, elven magic. That's one today. Total dark and brooding. She was certainly pretty. It's a small one company CEO. Okay, that's two people wanted. To, to dealing with ghosts. Ah, he did give information.
I wasn't paying attention to this man dude again. I think she owns the seal. Uh, he did give us information, and then she said, uh, we'll let you know if we find it. But, ah, uh, the other merchant made the offer first. Although, I guess the other guy didn't really offer anything other than promise, like, there'll be, like, stuff in the future. Wait, is that a scar on her head? Okay, um, uh, reliable shelters to craft and use items. Expose, and I don't know who to rest here. But they're reliable shelters, what do you mean I'll be exposed? Ah, one half hour mark. That's that sound effect. Road of riches. Okay, well. Man, looks like there's gonna be more oh. talking than I thought. Oh, I actually have quite a bit of money. Maybe I should think about investing in this stuff. Nah, just let's just go reckless. And uh, hopefully live to regret that. Warm bloods. Do you have blood then? Just a little colder. Oh dear. Do we have a map? This this looks like it's get okay. Okay, right exit. McHenry event. Only one McHenry event? At least one, but that means that there could only be there's there's a possibility that there is only one. Five errors to beat if you reach boss, okay. Not crazy terrible. This branch is like crazy, huh? Alright. That's a dead person. Lots of dead people. Where is my Geistometer anyway? These guys, I think they're supposed to be like, they're supposed to be Twitchy and Timbane, but they kind of look like robots because of that Twitchiness. I really don't like how I can't see the enemy until it's, uh... Yeah, I got full focus thing of Bobber. Oh, wait, that's, that's exactly what we're using it. Actually, this is cut off, I can't tell. Huh. That's... Okay, so there's symbols here, there, but there's a symbol on top. Oh, this is where you'd be, it's mid-range, so you gotta be, uh... Wait a minute. It's inverted! Right, I was right, it, it is inverted. Okay, so you'd be anywhere, but you only hit the mid- the, 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 It's mid-range, so you only hit the first two. Now let's kill the maid, I guess. Wait, what do you mean I can't kill the maid? I can't click? I have to select it with arrow keys? Oh, I should get used to play using the hotkeys. Wow, she's actually wearing a maid outfit. How much damage does that do? I didn't even pay attention. Okay, next is number two and number one enemy. I wonder if she could deal with these. Uh, probably not, but... Uh, Certainly try. It's annoying to have to pull this up to see their abilities though. Let's see, slash, slash me. Then that is. I want to see the flash bang. Making me select it if I hit all three of them. CB. Warlink. Wait, oh, I hit the wrong button, didn't I?
I don't even know how much he has left, but I'm gonna gun him down. Are you gonna scoot forward? You're still gonna be in the back. I guess you're still gonna be in the back. Right, can't reach from there with my sword. Rather short sword. They're in running too. And mercenary. Gun. I didn't see what that was. Lead, perhaps? I should be worried, huh? Hang on, I want to see what these do. Special shot, cover fire. Okay, that is some kind of bleed effect. Oh boy. Yeah, I didn't use War One properly. Okay, I want to shoot them though. There's a crossbow pickaxe. That that's pretty cool. Oh, you're just gonna keep healing, huh? That's fine. That's fine. Just gonna keep shooting. Wow, it's not dying. Nom 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 nom. Looks like gave her a strength buff and also made a bleed. Check this again. Two true damage all enemies. So is there the combat stat how much damage they normally do? I wasn't actually paying attention to that. Let's uh let's just check actually. She did only have a strength of two, right? Yep. Oh boy. Yep, okay, 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 that's exactly what it is. It's flinging food, huh? God, gotta finish him off. Let's see, what was your last one? The rally. All targets. All target allies receive one health. It's first house. Okay, okay. Uh, you know what? That's, uh, actually, can I finish him off? Only three damage. Okay, let's rally arrow one actually. Wow. You heal them bad, right? Pray. Flash out, I guess? Oh nope, don't have enough flashbangs. Damage to that guy. Oh, that looks like a crit. Finish him. Bounce. Oh, shift speeds it up. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Let's uh, just slash. Uh, she's not looking so good though. Okay, it took a little longer than I like. Spectre Dust. So it's the Dust Worm and a couple of them. Bullion chip. I don't know what bullion is, but gold bullion is like a block of gold. Trade probably. That was used by, as currency at Bugs on Air. That's the name. Oh, those probably take all but the neck bottom that I just wasn't looking at. Uh, let's see, map. You know, let's go in a straight line. I doubt my friend's going to be. Are they talking? Are they complaining about the gold? Wait, hold on. Can I decide to fix a lot? Definitely looks like she's doing lock picking from that symbol. Okay, and that wasn't anyone talking, that was just me talking to myself. Hey Jules! I see, it's cool, cool, cool. Get some crafting sometimes. Broken 
thread. I like this so. though. Definitely do the thick at all. Lots of chests here. I mean, I guess it's kind of realistic. In a storage area, you have a whole bunch of stuff. So they're having treasure scattered all throughout the world. Wood planks. Lots of stuff here. One man's junk is another man's treasure. I mean, I'll take it for sure. Salt helps keep food and makes it taste a little better, usually. Oh shoot. What was. Right, guys, in here. Codex. Oh, I pressed N by accident. Alright, so I think they'll tell me a little bit of lore, but I'm just going to go out there quickly. There's probably some detrimental drawback to doing that. Others get the rest. Okay. Double clicking does not do anything. I guess I hit E. Yeah, this game doesn't care about double clicking. Hmm. There's many very unique super to put it down, that's cool. What is this? Oh, that just cancels it. Huh, I wonder, like, did that do anything? She's frozen death, but that looks kinda cool. Yeah, I guess it's the exit. I guess that's it. It had anticlimactic. Normally I would go like serious loot mode, but um, I think this might be good. Also, I think that we got like a cutscene in the event or something. Whoa. Okay, that was just one small area. Uh, place to do some crafting, I think. Oh dang it, I did it again. I didn't actually get any crafting done. Or for me this is a crafting thing. Anyway, we definitely need one of these. was like, yeah, I think that was the camp. Should have used items then. Relics. Use while camping. I should move her to the back, shouldn't I? Uh, how do I... Right. Right. Um... Actually, wait, no, I can't even do it here. Or, actually, uh, yeah, I can do it on the screen. Uh, let's see, do you have... I mean, the other girl, uh, this girl has to stay in the front. I don't know if this is the best idea, I'm gonna do it. What, what's with all these sevens? Why can't I go there? It just doesn't connect. Okay, so it looks like we have a ways to go yet. Yeah. 
She looks like a fighter, but she's also the lock picking person too. Okay. Why is everything inverted? Is this inverted? I can't actually tell. I can't figure out what it says either, either way. All this loot. It's a loot room. Okay, tell you what. One more fight and now call it quits. Ah, oh, looked like it was a kid chilling out in the cold, and then the arms there. And there's like blood. Look at those eyes. Hey you! Hey, you. hey listen! Chop and candy. Uh, probably not lyric. I don't want her to die. You're in the back. You should be relatively safe. One Hellion. That's dirty Hellion. I had like 500. Ah, I guess it could have been worse. Probably bad for a figure, but actually I didn't actually order that much. It's still just by one. And frozen enemies here. Keep going before the guys get to us. Starting to feel like I should be afraid of those things. I hear someone laughing. Go trap. Yo. Oh, that's that's kind of disgusting. Avoid it though. <laughs> this this is booming. This frozen waste. I don't feel like it. Press onward. Whoa! Jeez, the ghost flying overhead. Especially with the style of the animation. Huh, I got to that in writing. Oh, and I end up going somewhere else. Keep a wary eye. Who's this? Hello, friend. Can I trouble you for a moment? <laughs> Please, not too much trouble. Let's hear what he has to say. Just not lonely spirit. Terror minus 30. A terror? Oh. Geist meter. They can sense our terror. Can't run here, I guess that makes sense. You want to move carefully. You know, I didn't realize it, but this girl, she 
Well, I can't see it, but she she has like a blade in her other hand. It's not a shield. I guess she is a rogue. I guess she's not wearing metal armor. Or I mean, not much metal armor. Well, uh, that was uh, kind of uneventful, but... Yeah, it looks like there's multiple places to go. You know what, I think I'll call it quits. Um, let's see if we could get a low... Oh, this is more camping stuff. Let's see if we can't craft a little bit more stuff. Get some drink in you. Okay, I don't have a whole lot in the way of drinks. What is that pouch? Like a pouch and some orange stuff. Gotta click there rather slowly. Whatever, we're gonna get some basic drink. And then we're gonna keep going. Although this is a good place to call it quits. Um, well, no one seems to have shown up to chat. Um, I do see a name, but as usual, I can't tell what's bar or not if you don't talk. Um, well, if uh, anyone ends up watching this VOD, I hope you had fun. I'll probably continue some other time, but I'm trying not to start too many series playthroughs at once. And I'm finishing up Hitman 2, but my current series playthrough is A Plague Town Innocence. I'll probably play Scar Nexus afterwards. Um, but I probably will get back to this periodically. I might play on my own time, too. But I've been playing less on my own time ever since I started the streaming thing. Anyway, hope you had fun. Have a good evening, or a good day, wherever you may be or whenever you may be, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.